expecting a record crowd from the neighboring counties. Naturally, we hope to break the record set by last year's Moose Fest in our neighboring town, Walkery. Ladies and gentlemen, some people have asked me, what's the big deal about Deer Fest? And I think that this sums it up. It's about friendship and community. We've got a great party coming up, though. Uh, let's try to hold it in until tomorrow and get through the night in one piece, all right? Someone will come for it when the time is right. Thomas said so. He wrote it. The key is insurance. It's my job to keep it safe. Safe in the light. Mm. Always in the light. Hello. Hello. Hmm. All the manuscript pages were gone. The FBI agent had taken them. I think... I think my tongue just took a... Crap in my mouth. Ugh. Ew. Oh, wait, we're in jail now? Oh, ow. <laughs> ow, this is not good. That about sums it up. Oh. I'm seeing that. Oh, I am never drinking again. Liar. Uh, I need to talk to Weaver. She's the one in the song. The Lady of the Light. What, the crazy lady? Ugh, whatever you say, we're Al, but we're stuck here. Night, They're not yeah, gonna... Even Wait. I had some reading to do first, Sheriff. And let me tell you, it was an interesting read. Well, I've got you now, Raymond Chandler. It's all here. All the evidence, including conspiracy to murder a federal agent. There's no way you're walking out of here. You hear me in there, Brett Easton Ellis? Huh? Agent Nightingale, I want to talk to your superior. Well, we all want things, Sheriff. I wanted my... <sighs> Look, that's not possible right now. Agent Nightingale, I insist. Ah, <sighs> uh, that's not good. Wake, what's wrong? Lady, are you stupid? It's a trick. It's an obvious trick. Okay, I've had enough of this crap. Wake, I'm gonna trust you with this. You're joking. Agent Nightingale, your opinion would matter more if you were sober and if I actually believed you were here on official business. Whoa! Get, get back in the cell, Stephen King. The only way you're leaving this place is over my dead... Wait a minute. I know this... Oh my God! Oh. Light, we need light. It's the only way to fight this thing. In my office. I've got your things there. Follow me. Uh, well, oh, there's man. a couple of manuscript pages. Dutch with the lights out. Stay cool. I okay. <laughs> I'll right off the bat, two, uh, two manuscript pages. Uh, <laughs> hello, my name is Rob Thumb, and welcome back to Alan Wake. Uh, that's one hell of a way to start an episode. Just... Okay, let's, let's read these things. Nightingale tried to make sense of the manuscript. It was disjointed and strange. He didn't understand half of it, but it all rang true, impossibly true. He took out his hip flask when he reached the page that described how he reached the page that made him take out his hip flask. It was uh -huh. the news that made his mind reel. That's funny. Nightingale felt the situation veering out of his control, but the gun at least felt steady in his hands. He was ready to fire, resolved that he would let this happen over his dead body. And yet he hesitated. He had seen this moment before, read it in the page. He was transfixed by the deja vu and the horror that he was a character in a story someone had written. Then the monstrous presence burst in behind him and dragged him into the night. The emergency power on. Okay. I like you. I don't like Nightingale. You're just uh, the stereotypical... I not believing until you see There we go. That's a V lights. Why are you only using one hand? Wake, what do I need to know? What do you need from me? They can be hurt in the light, only in the light, and I need to find Cynthia Weaver. She can help me stop this. Light. Check. Cynthia. She lives in the old decommissioned power plant. I can get you there pretty quickly in the rescue chopper. Come on. Let's get back to your friend. 
I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Oh. Wheeler, I need you to stay here. What? What the, what the heck? We're going to fetch our rides, but I have friends who need to be warned about this, and I can't be in two places at once. I need your help. Well, okay. Here's a Just list stay of in the light. phone numbers. I need you to call them and tell them you have a message from me. Night Springs, okay? Ooh. They'll know what to do. Night Springs? Like the TV show? Gotcha. Oh, flare! The radio guy is on the list, Maine. Who's Frank Breaker? He related to you? My dad. Hey, is this like a secret society? Can you do huh. this? You'll be safe here. The backup power is on. These guys need to be alerted just in case we don't come back. Uh, yeah. Ooh. You'll come back for me though, right? Talk to Thermos. As soon as we get the chopper ready. Thanks, Wheeler. I owe you one. Okay, let's go, Wake. Through the Okay. Back. I'm coming. On your six. Uh, hello, Breaker. This is Valley Z. Now it makes sense that you're using one hand. Previously it didn't make sense. Okay, oh, like hell. Whatever took Nightingale must have broken the gate controls. We can't reach the gate's control box from here. We need to get to the other side over the roof. I'll go. I'll open the gate for you once I'm across. You stay here in the light and cover me, Sheriff, okay? Are you sure? Okay, then. But hurry. It's not It's not my first rodeo with these little bastards. All right, so there. All right, got to go up, up this ladder. Come on. Let me up and over and through. Whoa. We go. I needed to reach the rooftop to get to the yeah. other side of the broken gate. I I, I know, uh, and I reached the rooftop by doing this. Ooh, that could have come down on my head. Could have had a whole final destination moment there. Hello. There's black goos everywhere. I see you there. Ooh, more flares. We like flares. Flares are helpful. Flares save bacon many, many times. And light. Yes, I know. Why must you keep repeating yourself? Just looking around, making sure I got everything. Upsy daisy. Come on. Gosh darn it, get, get on the, oh my lord. Nope, back. He would not climb up there. He just he just kept falling down. Blah, spins. Ow. Ow. Hey, the flare should be keeping you away from me. They're broken now. All right. Should be good. The crows are annoying, but they're not as dangerous as the uh, the shadow-touched people. Ugh. Hey, Sheriff. Your password. Night Springs? What's that all about? It's a stupid joke we have. That Bright Falls is the original inspiration for the TV show. This town can get weird at times. Never this weird, though. We need to bypass the damaged control box. What am I, an electrician? Hold on. <laughs> yes, Wake. Yes, you are. Need to make sure we get everything we can. Ooh, I see something shiny down here. Ah, it's a flare. 
Okay. Making sure to stock up on everything. And I think that's all we can get right now. Okay. Yeah, we're kind of stuck here. Owie! Oh, damn. That's smart. Good job, Wake. Okay, stick close. Our first stop is the town hall. The keys to the chopper are there. Okay. You realize that our light went out, right? Gotcha. Okay. Ow! Who? Ow! Nice work, Sheriff. Well, you're wasting a lot of ammo. A lot of ammo. Look out! Interesting, okay. He's not. Woo! Reloading. There we go. Let's go ahead and get this ammo. All right. I like having the sheriff around. She's very helpful. Much a lot better than Barry. There's him. All right. Can we hop in the truck? No. Uh, this way? Over here, Wake! The chopper's in the other direction! Yes, but there's a chest over this way. Ah, there it is. Flare gun! I like that. Let's save that for later, though. When things get desperate. Alright. Let's go. Hold on, what's in here? There's something. Uh, here we go. The air smelled of fish. This was Bright Falls Industrial Area. There was probably a cannery nearby. Whoa! Hey! Ow! Dodge! Don't land in the water, though. There we go. Gotcha. Okay. Ugh. That hurt a little bit. A 
It said there was a box or something over here. So up here? There you are. Another flare. Okay. All right, Sheriff, let's go. Shaughness kind of reminds me of Sheriff Judy from uh, the Supernatural TV show. Bright's Diner. Do I see shiny stuff down here? I think I see shiny stuff down here. It's a trap. A couple flares. Knew it. Uh. Sheriff, where'd you go? Okay. It's fine. Hi, Sheriff. I was fine. I, I kind of panicked for no reason. Open. Have a dude flashlight. Give me. Would you use a heavy duty flashlight like a weapon? That'd be cool. I see a thermos. I'm gonna want explanations, you know. For example, what the hell happened to Rose? She's seriously messed up now. The same thing I think happened to me after I arrived. During this week, you can't remember? Oh, I remember now. Yeah. Well, there's a manuscript page. Barry in the sheriff's Barry station. in his element. Making calls, making things happen, even if he didn't entirely know what those things were. He wouldn't let the hot sheriff check down. <laughs> even if every noise he heard from outside, and he heard plenty, made him jump. He had only paused to text Al a message, told him to hurry up. Suddenly, Barry froze in mid-dial. A window broke somewhere in the building, and then the lights went out. Oh, no. Bear, bear! Don't take my bear, bear! Coming, Sheriff. Is there anything in here? This looks like a place to hide something. No. Can't go in there. Alright. Sorry, Sheriff, I have to explore, because I gotta find all the manuscript pages to make sure the story is, uh... Whoa! Gotcha! And I thought New Yorkers were rude. Ha <laughs> ha! Where did you come from? Okay. Now I can go back and get these batteries. And the revolver ammo. Keep myself full. The porta potty's getting in the way. Hold on. Anytime you see a box, you need to open it and grab, grab whatever you can out of it. Hello? Closed. Hold on, Sheriff. That's nothing. Wait, over here. There's light. 
Okay. I'm exploring. This is why I'm exploring. I found a thermos and some revolver ammo and batteries that I don't need either of. I mean, it's a very nice back. It's an ambush. There we go. Dude is a chainsaw. Whoa! Hey! 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 Ow! Ah! ah. That was close. I was a little too close for comfort there. Okay, well, are we ready to go now? Okay. Another thermos! Find the thermos is everywhere. Give me the thermos. More flares. Up to 14 now. That's good. Someone's messed with the fuse box here. You should be able to jury rig it while I find the keys. I already got electrocuted once today. How about I look for the keys and you get burned for a change? <laughs> Fine. They should be in the clerk's office on the other side of the building near the main entrance. Gotcha. Okay. Well, there's another manuscript page. Dark presence the set back. That wore Barbara Jagger's face was furious. The story in the manuscript had been making it stronger all the time, but now the light had set the writer free and hurt it, weakened it. It was only a matter of days before the dark presence would be strong again. But meanwhile, it would be difficult to recapture the writer. Well, too bad. Hello? The message was from Barry. He was getting worried at the station. He wanted us to hurry. I'm doing the best we can, man. Hello. Come on. You bust down the door and then don't follow me? Where'd you where where'd you go? Oh there he is! <laughs> There we go. Okay. No. I'm almost out of... Ooh. Yes. 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 I was just gonna say I'm almost out of shotgun ammo. But, uh... And then, I, then I go and get a hunting rifle. Oh, thermos. <clears throat> nice little clock on the wall. That's the clerk's office. Yes! The big and... Ooh, and flashbangs? And a flare? All kinds of stuff in here. Thank you. Helicopter key. Okay, Sheriff. I got the keys. Sheriff? Barry? Why isn't he inside? Oh god. Oh god. 
No, 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 not my bear bear. Oh! Barry! He made it inside, Wake. He's okay. You sure about that? The storefront's locked. Come on, Wake. Let's go around. We can meet him in the back. I had... But my bear bear! My poor bear bear! It's closed, but you never know. Electricity. Okay. Well, it's an interesting statue. I don't like it. I don't like it at all. Okay. Barry, what are you doing? Uh-huh. Okay, well, before we go any further, we're going to go ahead and end this one here. Uh, I'm kind of glad Nightingale got taken, but at the same time, I know we're going to have to face him later, as he has, will have been taken over by the darkness. Um, I still don't understand what Nightingale's problem is. I mean, he's using a writer's book to try to prove that he's guilty of something. Most writers, especially the, Alan Wake specifically, are writing works of fiction. It's, it's fiction. It's not evidence of intent to do anything. <laughs> Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. If you did, please like the video, share the video, and subscribe to the channel because it really helps my channel grow. And as always, keep your head up. And keep moving forward. This is Roughnum, signing off. Bye-bye!